results in those situations when they are crouching. But Zane will just, it doesn't matter. He'll still go for the grab. So like yeah. if I feel like they're crouching a lot, I'm not risking the, the grab right. most of the time. So it's just interesting because I feel like he gets in a lot of Puff's heads in that sense and still just like gets these grabs that would normally not work. Yeah, not work or like seem a little telegraphed, but it's like, oh, it's Zane, you know? Like, like the Zane effect. Right. Yeah. So how much of it is that? And I'm just curious if Grab, I haven't seen him do this matchup in a while. So, oh, nice by Faust. Yeah, the reverse fair is a, a really good. Faust effort. looks like uh, they're really good versus Mario. I noticed that too, for sure. When I played Faust in friendlies last year, it was uh, it was hard. Right. You, who do you think wins this match as far as like uh, characters? I, I think Marth wins, but it's just one of those things. I feel like this is the case with Marth. A lot, a lot, a lot of, of Marth matchups yeah, are like it's, that. Yeah, it's just one of those like. How is your execution? So much of it is because I think in theory Marth just like trashes the cast. You know <laughs> yeah. what I'm saying? But like <laughs> it it doesn't just always work though. Right. Way. I see Marth struggle and all like his matchups has crazy variants. Yeah. You know? Yep. His flow chart's kinda hard when it's like not it's basically low key. <laughs> like overall, I think Marth right. Marth is such a like if you got rid of Spacey's, I think Marth's like such a harder character to use. Yeah, I'm probably not playing Marth than you get rid of Spacey. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> he's tough. Yeah. I Mar mean, like I he he's tough. I like the the weird matchups for the most part, but okay, nice. Ooh, nice, nice by grab. Yeah, see, that's like the execution test, right? You know. So you said grabs also Kentucky, right? So he's technically it's Kentucky, yeah. but it's Tennessee. More Tennessee. Yeah. I mean, How how's uh, the Kentucky scene? Like, do you guys like have stuff of just like? So just local shit. Out yeah, there. we do like uh, like grab Louisville play like uh, what's the other place in Kentucky? I'm Lexington. Of? Lexington. Yeah. yeah, like we kind of all have like little pockets, you know. And uh, so grab doesn't come to the Louisville like weeklies that often, but there are um, like five monthlies or every third month we try to host like a, uh, a bigger tournament. Right. And uh, grab like Essie, uh, Matt Tyro. Oh like, yeah, I forget those. Ohio like, is or like Cincinnati. Cincinnati's like an hour. Yeah, from yeah, us, yeah, yeah. You know? So it's not bad. Right. So. But yeah, grab, I've seen grab like you remember Amita? Yeah, Amita. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I played so, Amita in bracket before. Okay. Yeah. yeah so um, just that guy, but he yeah, was Amita's also dope. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> he's the homie. Yeah. Um, you know, I'm sure grab got a lot of practice in the matchup back in the day from Amita. That's where I learned the matchup. Yeah. Um, was playing him so much. Um, but this is okay. I was gonna say this is like the scary yeah. part of the matchup is just like getting nickel and dimed as Marth. Um, and the puffs like in kill percent, but you're trying yeah, to. These two, they feel them. real like. It seems like they're relatively close. So have, skill. have you noticed like you see how much that Faust is crouching? Yeah, that's what that I was rest. talking about. Yeah, yeah, so, so like I think Grab is gonna start picking. It seems like he already has where he's spacing himself in such a way that. You can't get wow, grab. wow. I, yeah, he died that all. That yeah. Was that was yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that should have killed him. <laughs> no, definitely not. Definitely not. I don't even think that was. That yeah, that was not. That wasn't the tipper. No, no was I was gonna say portion. I couldn't. I can't hear the sound effects very yeah, well, but no. No, I didn't look like it. Yeah, it was a regular four stretch. All yeah. right, well, and I guess that's we're a, going to Dreamland, right? And that's like what Marth can do, you know? Like you yeah. can just like string you it together. Push and puff away. Yeah, and, and it, wall and out. Grab is willing to play. You know what I'm saying? Like that, that walled oh. out. Okay. Yeah, um, what's the best move? Is it just that for it, damage? Honestly, that's probably what I would do too. Um, you can do, like Zane does the um, four throw. Or, yeah, yeah, he does, but that's like not real. You know what I mean? Like he, you could just get unlucky with like their DI. It's not even that they're reading, because you can do like four throw, down throw. Right, right, right. right. Into an aerial, and it's, it's fine, but oh, you got to get that. Okay. Oh, yeah, that grab right there was risky. Yep. Uh, how do you feel about Dreamland normally in this stage? Because, I mean, obviously, I feel like it's the worst stage, clearly. It's the worst stage. Um, there's, like, a few key moments that – oh, wow. I can't believe it sent him that way. Um, there's a few key moments that determine, like, just how bad the stage will be. You know what I'm saying? Like, if it seems like Grab is being able to, like, find the kills relatively easily. But if he's not, like, this stage just becomes a nightmare. I feel like this is a big, like – morale booster 
when you beat like public. Like when I, uh, <laughs> yeah. No doc, but when I beat Marf on FDE, like oh, that's yeah, such yeah. a morale boost. Oh, Because I'm like, yo, I, I think I'll just, I just got the set. Yeah, no. You know? if Marth goes up 2-0. Like I know we almost saw the reverse 3-0 from H Box. Yeah. Uh, was it SmashCon? But like, yeah, yeah. It's pretty much a wrap. Like, <laughs> yeah. yeah right? I, <laughs> you just don't. I don't know. You don't see. Because, like, you got you got so many. You got FD, you got Stadium, you got Yoshi's. St I love Stadium. Yeah, they're matchup. all good st stages. Okay. I like that. I like the light shot on flats um, from Grab. I do that a lot as well. Mm -hmm. Like the, the push off. Into what do you think? Uh, I know I'm asking a bunch of questions. But no, like, no, about ahead. with Grab in particular, what what stands out about his play relative to other marks that you've noticed? I, I I just think he is incredibly disciplined. Like yeah, he's uh, he's really hard to trick too. Right. Like he, if you could if you get him on something once, like he's got that mentally. Like, yeah, like locked. I'm not falling for that again. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Like he's like that. So like right. like I was talking about. So Faust is crouching a lot. He's trying to act immediately out of crouch. Mm -hmm. And so like now Grab is aerialing into immediate shield, mm -hmm. and that's why it's beating like the instant like CC F smash and you know the right. options out of CC. Right. So uh, he's just really good at adapting to who he's playing, um, is what I would say. But just real patient. He's hard to get in on, and I feel like that's the struggle that Puff has in general. Yeah. So. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it looked like he was trying to pivot, but he was either messed it up or. I mean, I could see that the DI was, it wasn't going to work regardless. Yeah, so he yeah. probably just bailed, honestly. Right, yeah. Okay. What percent, what percent was, does that stop working at? The, the fourth four throw, throw pivot, pivot tipper, smash. Yeah. Yeah. There's a whole chart on, uh, it's like an old Smash Force thread. I, uh, chat will probably oh, okay. correct me. But so I'm thinking it's like over, it's, what, like it, one, 150? It's weird. There's like a bunch of like, if Puff perfectly DIs, like, uh, it's so complicated. Yeah, nah, yeah, yeah but like a, a lot of, I mean, pretty much no puff perfectly DIs. Right, you know, right. in a lot of those situations. So like, unless it's like some accidental four throw pivot S smash should not work as much as it does even at the highest level. I'll just put it that way. Oh, okay. But it does, right. you know, and it's right. kind of like, I mean, that's the case with a lot of things in melee. I feel like right. there's so many not technically not like true. Right. You but do the that, right yeah. thing, but but on a human level. Yeah, it's yeah. still gonna, you know, it's just hard to execute in the moment. Okay. This is super close. Yo, I, I hate those pounds. It's yeah, like, yeah. They don't. Faust definitely goes for a yeah, lot. Of, I do remember that when playing him. I'm like, oh, like wow, he goes don't, for a lot. I, I, we net played before he was doing that, and I like, killed him every time. I was yeah, like, you, yeah. You get nothing off it. Yep. Like, he would just pound on my shield, up smash. Yeah. So I'm like, oh. I, Sometimes Puffs will use it as kind of like, you know how Pikachu like a, uses like up air to reversal them off yeah. the edge? Sometimes that can work against Marth, yeah. but like, the way he's been using it, I. Yeah, I don't. Really I, I, why that one's worse? Because at least Pikachu's it's quick. So if he whiffs, right, right, he's like, all right. But this one, you're like so exposed. Yeah. And I get it. I get like so sometimes you're just trying to get in and get a hard knockdown. Yeah. But I don't know. It's so slow that like if it misses, you're like kind of screwed. I forget if it was like Zane playing Roy in a <laughs> net play set with H box or something. Right. But he were there. He was playing. He was like commentating on his stream. I just remember this like very vividly. He's just playing and he's just like waiting, 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 and right. then pound, and then it, without fail, H Fox did pound exactly what he did. He did like four times. Right. I was like, oh my god, like <laughs> he's just waiting. I think this is the last pool too. Let me let me see what winners is brackets looking like. This is the last pool. So we got Wizrobe, Amsa, Moki, Kadoran, Club Aklo, and losers we got B Bats, Magi, Zuppy, Justice, Justice with the upset on yeah, Spark, wow. Polish. Um, he doesn't have an opponent yet. But yeah, we're waiting for this pool to finish. This is the last one. So this is definitely like set determining, in my opinion. Yeah. Grab clutches this. If he just stays patient, like he hasn't fallen for any of the the cheeky rest setups, you know. Mm -hmm. like the pound into rest, like the CC rests mm -hmm. on off miss grab opportunities. So flash and bend on the other stream. Ooh, okay, so right there, Ooh. he was like he rolled into it. And crouched immediately. Yeah, yeah. So and Grab was wise to just bail, you know. Ooh, nice roll it. by by uh, Grab actually. I like. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Like his defense created so much distance with that roll. He's totally fine with like resetting the situation. Right. Back up. Okay. He does it again? Yeah, he's like not risking the ledge at all. Yeah. He's just he's chilling. Yeah. I mean, he has he's such a lead. It. Nice. And damn. He's all. He is really I good know. at reading uh, aerial drift as well. Like. Yeah. 
Got the turny nerves, little shakes there. Yeah, yeah. The Coca-Cola shirt. But yeah, now, yeah, I think grab 63% prediction. Ben and who? Ben and Flash. Oh, dang. Yeah, they're going crazy. Yeah, Minnesota's been going crazy all weekend, <laughs> and I mean, we're in Ohio. So. Yeah, yeah. That's a nice little rivalry, Minnesota, Ohio. Like, right, right. Yeah. It's a little Midwest. Does Kentucky have a rivalry with? with it, it used to be Indiana. Oh, yeah. yeah. Like, well, at yeah. least Louisville. Like, yeah. most of our players. I feel like a lot of Indiana stopped playing. Man. It, they were strong. But there's still, them. like, some good. There are some good players, though. I will say, like, Blue. Yeah, um, Blue, yeah. I remember, like, the Rick and Lance era. Yeah, just, the Rick and Lance era, yeah. man. Ooh, they're going. Oh, ape. Right? <laughs> People were banging on stuff out there. Are they, are they <laughs> been one? It sounds like it. Yeah. <laughs> Even though we're in Ohio. <laughs> yeah. They're gonna go crazy regardless. All right. Somebody's group's going nuts. No, but yeah, the Rick and Lance era. Yeah. <laughs> shout outs to Rick and yeah, Lance. Yeah, shout outs to Indiana Miller. Voorhees. Yep. Yeah, there were some uh, some good rivalries back then. All right. So now Faust uh, picking up the pieces. Shout out to the sponsor, uh, Pulse. So this is kind of what I was talking about that I was expecting to see a little bit of last game, but didn't just like the, you know, being really difficult to close out stocks. Oh wow, that's one way to do it. But <laughs> yeah, I, I just feel like Faust isn't quite making the most out of the Ooh, that, Dreamland. Oh. Yeah, in what way? Benefits. Just like he's, I don't know. I feel like he should be Ooh, more good. down to just hang out when he's at that percent, you know, right. and to just really try to poke and nickel and dime. Mm -hmm. But I think he's just a little too impatient. Right. Right. See, I don't go for those grabs, those like those raw grabs like that. Yeah, and you I probably Zane should, does that. Yeah, right? Zane does it too. Yeah. But it's it's so scary. It seems like they try to grab while like Puff's about to jump. Jumps, yeah, like while she's moving. Right. While she's like, yeah. Right. Okay. Oh, up tilt. Nice. Up All right. Tilt. Grab brought her right back. Perfect. Sound like a whole stop. Yeah. Oh, oh. Yeah, nice. Way that was almost that all bad. All right, Faust. Okay. So still, nice CC. Yeah, still getting away with the CC. Oh, got to get his edge guard. Oh, oh, oh. no. That's, that's huge miss That is definitely huge. On Dreamland uh, especially. Yeah, Dreamland's a huge lead. <laughs> yeah, He's but can, and diamond his yeah, way back. You can piece up Puff. Like, yeah. you can put on damage oh. real quick. Yeah, it's like basically even again almost. Well, the Faust fair. Oh, he kind of died that bad too, but yep. they, like Dream Last Day. <laughs> Pound finally worked out for oh. a little bit. Rest? Oh, we should rest. Yeah. That's it. Nice, okay. nice. All good right. Way, good way. Faust on the board, yeah. So Ben over Flash. Gatsu versus Axe will be next on the other stream. See, to me, this is where, like, Man, even though it's 2-1, it just it feels so bad for Puff. <laughs> just because like we right. have so many good stages as Marth mm -hmm. to deal with. Getting that Dreamland win is so big. Oh, rest. Yo. Get out of there, yep. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. See man, that pound is like he got the hit, but what what you get off? Right, exactly. You didn't even get like a good neutral follow-up off of it. I think Puffs are used to like having a better risk reward against like Fox, I guess, because they yeah. can net them like edge guards or it just plus not Fox rest. is like how he knocks down is just kind of more brutal. It's easier to follow up off of. Right. Mark. Ooh, wow. Nice, nice. He's, he's nailing a lot of these like raw F smashes. Yep. Wave dash out. Yeah, nice. F smash. Nice. Oh, counter. Interesting. Oh, that oh dash attack. Goodness, right? I've seen a lot of Mark this weekend. Yep. Oh, worth. Definitely. I still worth. Yeah, it's worth. You got it. damage, you know? Oh. And you got stage. Oh, almost. Up air. Okay. Oh, okay. I think uh, Faust should be looking for. If, if, as far like, as what, what makes it, what makes the good puzzle or the like, like the hungry box is better than like 
just a decent pub, you know what I mean? Yeah, I think like uh, just aerial drift timings, mm -hmm. that's a really big thing that H-Box does so much better than the rest. And then like his movements off of platforms. Like yeah. H-Box is actually really fast at uh, moving off of platforms. Yeah, he edge cancels a lot. People yeah. talk about it a lot. Like drill edge cancel into something, like mm -hmm. that's solid. When Mark's right. just kind of chilling in center stage. Right. And a lot of, I'm just kind of ribbing it. But that's the that's the nice thing you have in this. Uh, the risk reward is just so good. Like if you whiff, you the way he's facing it, the worst that's gonna happen is he's gonna get clipped with the, the back. Right, hit. worst case. Right. Yeah. Right. But if if he nails it, you could get like bad DI, it could be a kill. Mm -hmm. Ward though. Oh, I'm, yeah. Okay. Oh, oh wow. wave after wave. <laughs> <laughs> wave for wave, goodbye. Yeah, wave <laughs> for the fans. Yeah. <laughs> You know what I never got about the stage that makes zero sense about how they designed it? What's that? The arena is above the crowd. So if you're in the bleachers, in the nose oh. bleach, how are you, if you're on the ground level, how are you going to see the match? Look at the, look at this. Uh, that's arena. actually a really good point. It makes zero sense to me. I always thought that was weird. <laughs> wow. That was Maybe super off topic. But. What's like below stage? Like, See, because like, look like at all those people way down yeah. there. Those are those are supposed to be the good seats. What's below they're just like the main up. like platform? Is it just like an empty void? Or is there like multi-levels? I don't know. Is it like the Elite Four? Like... You know, where maybe, like, maybe, maybe like I'm thinking it's like a. It was on the bottom, and then over time, it just they got like they just elevated it in the air. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> Still wouldn't make sense, but grab with the three-one. 